Hi, I'm Alistair, Chief Pharmacist at ECHO. Today we're talking about atorvastatin, which is a statin, the clues sort of in the name. Atorvastatin is really helpful for people when their cholesterol level's too high and we need to get that under control. What's cholesterol? Well, cholesterol is a substance that the body makes and it's a vital part of every cell membrane and it's a useful building block for things like vitamin D. So we need it, but we need the right amount in the right place. Cholesterol is carried around in the blood in tiny little balloons made of fat and protein and the sort of fat that you've got in your diet helps to make sure that you've got the right kind of balloon that's carrying things around. We want as much cholesterol as possible to go in good cholesterol, which is HDL. It's high density, it isn't gonna burst so easily on the way around the body. And so the more avocados, olive oil, oily fish, that sort of thing that you eat, great. If your diet is really high in red meat, dairy, those sorts of fats, there's gonna be a tendency for your body to make less sturdy balloons that can burst and that means that the cholesterol is going to fall out and it can clog your arteries as it goes around. To demonstrate cholesterol I've got confetti filled balloons. The confetti is cholesterol and the balloons are the little bubbles that carry it around in your body in the bloodstream. On this side it's good cholesterol, they're small, they're firm, they're less likely to burst. On this side it's bad cholesterol and so over a lifetime lots more of these are likely at some stage to burst and that leads to the cholesterol clogging up your arteries. So we've got safety pins and we try to burst those ones all fine and... <laughs> cholesterol. There's loads more info on atorvastatin, on healthy eating, all sorts of stuff like that from trusted NHS sources. So check out the links and see you next time.